starts now at 11. Still developing at 11, two men are wanted by police tonight for their role in a shooting that sent a little girl to the hospital. Good evening to you. I'm Brian Loftus. I'm Denise Valdez. It happened near Tropicana and Spencer just a few hours ago. 8 News Now reporter Brittany Edney is there now with more on what police say happened tonight. Brittany? Brian and Denise, a seven year old little girl, well, she went through a really traumatic experience tonight after she got shot in the back after her dad got into an argument with just two random guys on the street. And Metro investigators that I spoke with tonight, they say that the good news they can tell you is that she is expected to survive. Now, I want to walk you through what happened. There's this car right over here behind me in the distance along Tropicana. And Metro investigators told me that the father, he was getting into that car when he had. Had some words, uh, some kind of argument with two gentlemen that were just walking down the road, and that's when when one of the men actually pulled out a gun and started shooting. That little girl was in the car and got shot in the back. Now she was taken to Sunrise, and that is where she is being treated tonight. Again, she is expected to be okay, but investigator says this just goes to show you how quickly something like this can escalate. A small situation can turn into something that could have possibly been deadly. They said that they want to do, they're going to do everything they can to find the shooter so that they can get justice for this seven year old little girl. And while well, Metro says they have a pretty clear description of those two men tonight and they're actually looking for them in the surrounding area possibly in a neighborhood that's right behind the shopping center that I am we haven't officially gotten a suspect description that we can share with you tonight but we'll keep you posted on that but I can tell you that uh, they are again looking for them in that nearby area and I want to remind you that while they are looking for those two men only one of them was the shooter we're going to continue to keep you posted on everything that happens with this story but again that little girl is expected to be okay. Reporting live, Brittany Edney, 8 News Now.